It's time to meet the starters for the teams, beginning with the visiting Los Angeles Lakers. At small forward, Rui Hachula. At shooting guard, Austin Reeves. At the other guard position, D'Angelo Russell. At center, Anthony Davis. At the other forward position, LeBron James. Sports. We've got some NBA action coming up for you. And tonight we'll see the Toronto Raptors as they go up against the Los Angeles Lakers. This is Brian Anderson. I'm here with Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke, our reporter, Ali LaForce. And the Lakers starting five. D'Lo and Reeves are the backcourt duo. It's LeBron at power forward. AD as the center. And it's Achimura in at the three. And for the Raptors, they've got Scotty Barnes. Bruce Brown is out there with Emmanuel Quickly. Then there's Jakob Pertl, and it's Barrett. In at the three. All right, folks, get your running shoes on. Both of these teams want to push the pace. Oh, that they do. Pace, pace, pace. And as a fan, I just love these types of matchups. It's so much fun to see these teams get up and down the floor, play with pace, and have fun. I'm excited for this one. Now here's Hachimura. To the middle. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. What's striking about LeBron James is how his game has morphed to now it's all about guile and smarts and experience. He continues to dominate just in a different way. He's off on the second. And Doris, since winning the title in 2019, the Toronto Raptors have been a little inconsistent as of late. They certainly have, B.A. They've been in and out of the playoffs since then. Certainly, you look at some of the pieces they have, nice pieces. But you've got to have more if you want to compete. Now, here is James. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Barrett. James with the ball. Davis with a screen on Barnes. Releases. That one a tad offline, but it drops in for him. Yeah, not a lot to be done if LeBron gets a solid screen in a pick and roll set like that one. Russell against quickly. Pass to Barrett. Hurdle with a screen on Achimura. Back to quickly. There's the three. Rebound, the Lakers. Now here's Russell. 
Davis a screen beyond the arc. Hurdle grabs a miss. And you never want to give a shooter like him a clean look. To the inside. Here's Barnes. And he comes up with a bucket. You love how Scotty Barnes embraces the challenge of a contested shot. Don't back down, Scotty. Pass to Davis. Over Pirtle. And that one's good. Davis. Tremendous individual play. I mean, challenging the heart of that defense. Now quickly to the paint. Here's Brown. And he drops in the layup off the glass. And he gives up some size inside, but makes a great adjustment on the finish. Well, he's attacking, he's forcing the issue, and that's simply stated a terrific play. Now, here is James. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. LeBron James always ready to sacrifice for the play. Absorbs the contact, draws the foul, gets the shot off. Shooting for Los Angeles. LeBron James. Two shots. And he makes a first. Olenix checked in for Toronto. Good on both. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Quickly against Russell. Oh, they get a hand on it. James with a steal. Fast break. Here come the Lakers. And then Russell with the dunk. This is why you run your offense through LeBron. Great vision, great decision maker. Pass to Olenek. Now here's Barrett. Hurdle with a screen on Achimura. Just five to shoot. Back to quickly. He drops it from range. This is the court awareness that gives you great hope for R.J. Barrett. He's a scorer, but if he can complement that with passing, look out, folks. Now here's Russell. Achimura outside. Inside. Here's James. And it's James with the jam. Well, you can see the eagerness to contribute from Rui Hashimura. Finds the open man willing to facilitate. Pass to Barrett. Rebound by the Lakers. Davis with it. He's picked up by Pirtle. Russell deciding where to go with it. Hachimura in the post. Guarded by Quickly. And so it's Brown with it. He brings it up for the Raptors. Trailing by four. Quickly passes to Pirtle. Outside Barrett. Outside Brown. Raptors need to get off a shot. He buries it from three. Quickly, he's got six. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. And here's James. Seven points in the game. And there's the screen. From outside the arc. Hurdle grabs a miss. The Raptors have gone four of seven, shooting a solid percentage. Barrett finds quickly. Pass to Pirtle. Back to quickly. And a nice finish on the layup. They give him eight points now. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. Quickly against Russell. Here's Davis. Takes it into the teeth of the D and converts the layup. Hard to defend that any better. Davis is just so talented and poised inside. Pass to Pirtle. Quickly against Russell. 
and it's quickly. That time on the assist by Pirtle. What a terrific play by just a tremendous all-around player. This guy makes it look easy. James against Olenek. Hachimura outside. Here's Reeves. Back to Hachimura. And he lobs it up. And Davis slams it home. And you love how effortless Davis makes this look. Rising up for an alley-oop like it's nothing. Russell against Quickly. Pass to Barrett. The Lakers with a rebound. Probably should have scored there. He usually does. Outside for Russell. Shoots from 12 and misses it off the right side of the rim. The Raptors have got six of 10 attempts to fall. And here's Brown for three. Davis with a rebound. Davis has got four rebounds in the game. Pass to James. Back to Davis. And Davis gets double teamed. Now Russell. Reeves the pass to Davis. Out to James. Fires the three. Pirtle grabs a miss. Pirtle's got four rebounds now. Quickly against Russell. And here's Olenek. Outside, Brown. Outside, Barrett. And again, Toronto, no good. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 3 from downtown. Davis, the pass to Reeves. Davis with it. Outside Russell. Two minutes left. Eight Here's James. Seven points in the game. Here's Reeves. Offline with a three. He's got a great defensive mind. He gets good position and affects the release. And he did it without fouling. And that's become an art. Changing shots without making contact. Now here's Barrett. Get to see a basket. And there it is for him. Oh, that's a big time grit by R.J. Barrett. You want some contact on me? I can finish anyway. The Lakers trail. Oh, 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 oh. 125 left to play in the first. Here's James. That falls. Nice assist by Russell. James has got nine. Now put your head down and go to work. That's what they need to do. Boy, the tide is running one way and then shifts back in the other direction. I've lost count of how many lead changes we've had here tonight. Barrett. Here's Pirtle. And he buries his first look. This team loves it when Pirtle can make an impact on the offensive glass. There's a lot of ways he can get his points, but this is an easy one. Now here's Russell. And Davis gets double teamed over Pirtle. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. That's on Jakob Pirtle. Shooting for Los Angeles. Anthony Davis taking two shots. That free throw, good from Davis. You know, Davis is still one of the most feared defenders in the league. He's not the guy you want in front of you when you're coming down the lane. Both good from the line that time. Boy, a really soft touch on display. It is a luxury to have a big man who can hit from the line at a consistent rate. Outside Barrett. There's 37 seconds left in the first quarter. Down to five on the shot clock. Barrett missing again. That's a shot he makes with regularity, but that time the defense up to the challenge. Pass to Mitchell. Here's Dick. 
Olenek with a screen on James. Rejected by James. Wow, LeBron James sends it back. <laughs> LeBron on the defensive end. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for Los Angeles. Hunting for opportunities, leading to nine points in the quarter. Time for a quick break, then back to the action. And this has been a fairly close game through the first quarter. We'll see what happens here in the second. Taking a look at the Lakers' performance here, guys. What are your thoughts? Well, we've watched them force their way to the line, and it seems to be working so far. And this is why coaches say be aggressive. As long as you're playing smart, good things tend to happen, even if you're on the road. And here's Mitchell. He'll bring it up for Toronto. They trail by one. Chris Boucher out there with Scotty Barnes. Then there's Mitchell. Then there's Dick. And it's Olenek in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's the five out there for the Raptors. Oh, he muscles it in through the contact. They call the foul, and he's on his way to the line. Well, you love the commitment from Scotty Barnes. Made his decision, Defense makes down. the contact, and the end one. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Raptors. They've done a great job facilitating so far. So moving the rock and finding the open man, just great selfless basketball. I think the other thing they've done a great job of is making their presence felt inside, converting tons of pain opportunities. So, Grant, if you were a GM and you could choose one young player to build around, who would it be? Wow, that's a great question. I mean, PA, I, I think you have to go with Victor Wimbanyama. I know he's a young fella. He just got drafted. But the upside is so huge for this young man. His talent, his skill, his size. He is the next iteration of Kevin Durant, in my opinion. And I would go with him. He's got a lot of runway in front of him. A lot of years to get better, get stronger, and to win championships. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Ali. Well, R.J. Barrett, the third overall pick in the 2019 draft, still a long way away from his prime. He said, quote, people think you should make this huge leap out of nowhere. And it's like if you just add one or two things to your game and just get better every year steadily, you are going to get where you want to go, whether it comes right away or it comes later. Brian? Ali, thanks. Here's Vanderbilt. After the basket by Toronto. Wood. And Wood with the stuff. How about Christian Wood finishing with authority? Okay, young sir. Barnes with it. He's got five. Boucher finds Barnes. Second chance effort. Tipped. Here's Vincent. That three's off the mark. Toronto trailing. Pass to Barnes. Oh, and a vicious dunk by Barnes. That's big time length and athleticism by Scotty Barnes, leaving no doubt. And here in the second, two minutes gone by. James, a screen on Mitchell. Here's Vincent, checked by Mitchell. Outside Reddish. Sinks the tray. And the Lakers lead by two. One team gains momentum, then the other storms back. Hey, if this is any indication of how the game is going to go, we're in for a treat. Now here's Barnes. He has seven. That's good. For the day, he's four for six. Boy, Scotty Barnes, the complete package. Nice interior finish there. Vanderbilt with a screen. 18 feet away again the Lakers score and his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight now, I think that's the one thing every player is searching for Consider
consistency. They're giving this guy a chance to carry the offense once again. Here's Vincent. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. And now it's a four-point Los Angeles lead. Barnes against Reddish. Outside for Boucher. The three. That's it. Coming off an assist from Barnes. Now this is a young guy stretching the big position, right? Because Boucher very willing to rise and fire from downtown. Now here is James. 14 points for him. Pass to Vanderbilt. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his first personal foul. The free throw dropped for Vanderbilt. And the Raptors with some changes. Hurdles checked in for Olenek. Brown comes in for Boucher. And quickly subbed in for Mitchell. Hachimura's checked in for the Lakers. D'Angelo Russell comes in for Vincent. Now here's Barnes. Nine points in the game. Vanderbilt pulls it in. For Los Angeles, they've gotten five of their first six attempts to fall in the second. Out of bounds, it'll be Toronto's ball. You can tell the moment the pass left his hands, he knew he messed up. The Lakers making a switch here. Vincent's checked in. Barnes feeling it out a bit. Going inside. Pass to Dick. Outside, Brown. Here's quickly, guarded by Russell. Here's Barnes. Three-pointer. And again, Toronto, no good. He is just so deadly from out there. You expect that to fall. Vanderbilt, a screen on Barnes. It's stolen by Barnes. Quickly, outside. Down low. Here's Brown. He nails it, and we're tied. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. Vanderbilt, a screen on Barnes. James passes to Vanderbilt. Out to James. Takes a three. Rebound by the Raptors. Myrtle's got seven rebounds in the game. Left side, Brown. Barnes in the post. James is there. Barnes, no good. And James has got the ball here for the Los Angeles Lakers. Outside, Russell. Back to James. Pass to Russell. Hachimura outside. Five to shoot. Pulls up on the wing. Pirtle grabs a miss. Pirtle's got eight rebounds in the game. Quickly outside. Now here's Barnes. Checked by James. Barnes passes to Brown. Puts up a deep three. That shot off the mark. Los Angeles has gone two of four from the perimeter in the second so far. Outside Vanderbilt. Back to Achimura. Vanderbilt with a screen. Achimura, the pass to James. James can't get that one to fall. No idea why he's attempting so many outside shots. It's not his day, and he needs to either look to drive or get it to an open teammate. Back to Barnes. Here's Dick. Hachimura covering. Dick gets the bucket. Shooting through contact. Brady Dick has a compact release that holds up well. Timeout called. The Lakers.
Davis. He's checked in for Los Angeles. Reeves comes in for Vincent. Here's Russell. Well, Grant, with his size and range, Grady Dick is a ready-made floor spacer. Oh, this kid is lights out shooting the ball, B.A. Such a threat to defenses. You can't lose track of him. He's always moving around the floor. Now here's Davis. Give him eight. Shot clock at five. Shot is good by Reeves. Reeves has gotten himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Achimura against Barrett. Pirtle with a screen on Achimura. Barrett passes to Pirtle. Uses the glass on the layup. And the Raptors lead by one. I think his frame makes him very difficult to deal with as a roll man. Pirtle can set a mean screen. Pass to Vanderbilt. To the inside. It's stolen by Pirtle. Lakers foul. D'Angelo Russell. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for your Raptors. Emmanuel quickly. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. The Raptors making a switch here. Barnes is checked in. And quickly drops them both. You want to contest this guy's shot, but you absolutely don't want to send him to the line. He will make you pay. Reeves, the pass to Davis. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. That's on Jakob Pertle. You can't let Davis get established positioning inside. If he does, you have to foul him. Taking two shots. Free throw, good from Davis. Both free throws, good from Davis. A minute 53 left to play in the second quarter. Quickly finds Barnes. And there's a whistle. That's going to go on Jared Vanderbilt. That's his first foul of the game. Personal foul. Third team foul. Barnes passes to Pirtle. Pass to Barrett. Six on the shot clock. That one falls. Barrett's got his second basket of the game. This is a relentless scorer who is unafraid to work on the inside. In the paint, RJ making his presence felt. Now here's Davis. He's got 10. Reeves. The Lakers with another miss. Brown looking around. We've got 108 left in the first half. The three, Barrett. Gets it to go. Three makes, nine attempts. Now Barrett has got to become more consistent, but if he adds consistent three-point shooting, turn the lights out. Davis with a screen on Barrett. Hachimura in the post. Guarded by Barrett. And it's Hachimura missing. You will have to finish harder than that if you want to convert in traffic. Outside, Brown. Three-pointer, no good. Los Angeles has gone three for seven from the perimeter during the second quarter. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. And Davis gets double-teamed. Vanderbilt finds Russell. Gets the three ball to go. Russell's got five now. Well, the lefty stroke of D'Angelo Russell on display. This is a guard who can be effective with and without the ball. Quickly outside. Barrett passes to Pirtle. Lays it up and banks it in. He's got six. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Raptors out in front, up by five. We'll take a quick break and then get you back to the action. 14.
And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. You know, LeBron James has been exceptional here, guys. I love how effortlessly he scored. The game just comes so easy for him. And let's see if he continues that trend the rest of the way. He certainly has the talent and the endurance to do just that. Now here's quickly on the court for the Lakers. It's LeBron at power forward with AD as the center. D'Lo and Reeves are the backcourt duo. And it's Achimura in at the three, the small forward. Now here's quickly leading by five. Just five on the clock. Pirtle with a screen on Achimura. There it passes to Pirtle. And the shot goes down. Pirtle's got eight points. Well, critical in the pick and roll that you be able to deliver the ball in a timely spot and in the right position. And R.J. Barrett does just that. Russell against Quickly. The baseline J is on the way. Russell, that's good. What an incredible ankle breaker to help create space for his shot. And so it's Brown with it. He brings it up for the Raptors. Second half, getting started. About a minute play. Oh, and a vicious dunk by Barnes. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning, too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Where was the defense? No fighting through the pick. No rotation. My goodness. Back to Russell. Davis with a screen on quickly. The shot by Russell, no good. The Raptors with a lead. Brown finds quickly. Just a little over 90 seconds gone in the third quarter. Here's Barrett. Davis for the rebound. Davis has got his eighth rebound here tonight. Pass to Achimura. Here's Reeves. James, outside. And here's Achimura, guarded by Quickly. Outside Russell. The three is up. Another miss by Russell. For Toronto, they've got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. Outside, Brown. Now Barrett, guarded by Russell. Quickly against Achimura. Let's it go from 11. The Lakers with a rebound. Outside Russell. Pass to James. Davis with it. Guarded by Quickly. Hachimura outside. On target from range. Hachimura's got his first three points of the game. And this is what we're seeing. Rui Hachimura understanding I've got to expand my range. This is huge for his development. Now here's Barrett. Seven points in the game. Outside Barnes. Hachimura against Barrett. Oh, what a finish in traffic! My goodness! Good concentration from the man out of Toronto, Ontario, R.J. Barrett. Go ahead with the contact finish. James against Barnes. LeBron without hesitation. And it's James with the jam. Huge bucket at the rim, and they cut into that lead. That's exactly where he likes to make his living. Pass to Brown. Rebound collected by Anthony Davis. Boy, that's the kind of look this offense is designed to create. That's just a tough miss. Now James. He's got 16. Russell from outside. And another three for the Lakers. Well, it's important that D'Angelo Russell keep making shots from deep. This is an aspect of his game he's starting to sharpen. Toronto calls timeout. Here is Barrett. Nine points in the game. Hurdle with a screen on Achimura. 
James brings the double team. The three from Barnes. That's his six making 11 tries. It's problematic for the defense because Scotty Barnes has been allowed to catch his rhythm and his game is really flowing right now. James against Barnes. It's stolen by Pirtle. Now here's quickly. Not a lot of room. That's his second personal. And let's take a moment here to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for the Raptors. I mean, they play some beautiful basketball all game. The passing has been impressive, and it's opened up things with their ball movement. I also like how they've played in the painted area. They've made an effort to work on the inside and convert those chances. And he drops the first. Vincent checked in for Los Angeles. So one for two that time at the stripe. And so James will bring it up for the Lakers. Pass to Russell. Back to James. inside you call this a groove folks offensively when shots are falling you're getting to your spots lebron james right now on his personal playground james against barnes inside and wrestling for it there but no one has possession we'll have a jump ball Pass to Barrett. Clock at six. Now quickly. Brown finds Barnes. Good. And Brown gets the assist. Brown's got three assists in the game. When the defense gives you room, take it. Don't pass up the shot. Now here is James. Here's Davis. And it's Toronto with a rebound. Barrett's got four rebounds now. Pirtle with a screen on Davis. Barrett passes to Pirtle over Ashimura. And the Raptors getting another bucket right there. Boy, getting his points the hard way. Jakob has to absorb contact and able to use his strength there. Well, Grant, for R.J. Barrett, he pretty much knew he was going to be an NBA player. Oh, B.A., he sure did. And the number one prospect out of high school in Florida in 2018. Did his one and done in college at Duke and followed it up with the number three overall pick. And he is definitely delivered. And the whistle blows as the basket counts. Chance at a three-point opportunity here. One free throw coming up. Defensive foul. Anthony Davis. Well, of course, Scotty Barnes won the Rookie of the Year in 21-22, guys. And you talk about a well-rounded basketball player who will affect winning with both his offensive ability and his defensive versatility. Here's Vincent. Pass to James. And it's Toronto with a rebound. Hurdle's got 13 rebounds in the game. Glass heating. <laughs> Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. At the line for Toronto. The free throw drops for quickly. Olenek's checked in for Barnes. And quickly drops them both. Los Angeles has gone two of three from outside so far in the third quarter. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. For NBA players, off-the-court physical training has become paramount. And Celtics big man Al Horford told me the day-to-day -day grind has changed. Before, it was just basketball. Now these other routines are being incorporated, and it's really changing the game. And Brian, it's not just the veterans. Even the young players are seeing the benefits as well. Yeah, they really are, and you got to do it. Thanks, Alec. Boucher's checked in for Toronto. Vanderbilt's checked in for Los Angeles. Reddish comes in for Achimura. And Toronto has possession. They're leading by eight. Outside Davis. To the left side wing. Russell finds Davis. 
Davis drawing the double team. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Jump ball called on the play. Vanderbilt, a pass to Russell. Just four to shoot. For three. Benson can't hit. Toronto has gone 5 of 12 from three-point range tonight. Quickly against Russell. Quickly passes to Barrett. Los Angeles Dick, he's checked in for Toronto. Mitchell comes in for Quickly. And the Lakers also making a switch. Lewis is checked in. Here's Mitchell. The D's right on him. Six to shoot. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. That is third. Had he played a stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. At the line. That free throw is good for Mitchell. James has checked in for Lewis. Both free throws good for Mitchell. James with the ball. Pass to Vincent. To the paint. Here's Davis. Ooh, coming through again. Shooting five for seven now. And I'll tell you what, if you're going to mix it up with Davis, you better be on your game. He's so powerful inside. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That's his second personal foul. Team is in the penalty. At the line. The first free throw is good. He's perfect from the line this time. 152 left to play in the third. To the middle. Here's Vanderbilt. And the layup falls. Well, use the pick and going right to the cup. I love the aggressiveness. And here's Mitchell. He'll bring it up for the Raptors. Pass to Barrett. From deep. Rebound collected by Anthony Davis. Davis has got 11 rebounds in the game. Davis with a screen on Mitchell. With a nine-footer, count the basket. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. You know, we see this all the time. You're basically, as a defender, hoping the man misses rather than putting in the work to get over screens. Boucher a screen on Reddish. Here's Barrett. That one goes in. Barrett's got 11 points. Well, what a job. Punching the ball to the interior and finishing in the paint. Nice. 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's Davis. Tried to bank it in, but it misses. Good offense beats good defense? Not always. Here's Dick. And the Raptors getting another bucket right there. 26 seconds left in the third quarter. Davis. I would imagine it's nearly impossible to not get fired up after that play. Grant, check these guys out on the bench. Their reaction says it all. They are fired up. And so it's the Toronto Raptors up by a healthy eight points at the end of the period. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. 
<laughs> you can count on him to deliver a few assists like this one each and every night. You know a thing or two about a point guard's job. Set the table for your teammates. Done there perfectly. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. The Lakers trail. Kelly Olenek is out there with Chris Boucher. Then there's Barnes. Then it's Davion Mitchell. And it's Dick in at the two guard. So that's the five in the game for Toronto. Now here is James. Wood, a screen on Barnes. Here's James. It's rebounded by Dick. Well, the Raptors shooting about 56% in this one. Outside Mitchell. Pass to Dick. Shot from the top of the key. Rebound, the Lakers. Ugh, he forced that one. Not a productive trip up the floor. And in a way, by taking that one, he's bailing out the defense. It's just too easy to stop. Vanderbilt's gone. One of three shooting so far. Into the lane. Rejected by James. Vanderbilt inside. Boucher on it. Vanderbilt, no good. Aggressive mindset, but the defender just as determined to send him away empty-handed. Outside Mitchell. Boucher on the screen. The drive by Mitchell. And again, Toronto, no good. The Lakers have got none of their shots to go in this final quarter. 0 for 4. Pass to Wood. And here's Reddish. Here's James. Here's Vincent. From outside, off the mark. That's not his spot, but given the lack of defense, you'd like to see him knock that one down. Dick. And some very quick points for him on that possession. And the Raptors lead by 10. Yeah, we know this about Scotty Barnes. He has a team-first mindset. Finds the open player in that instance. Time called here. The Lakers decide to talk it over. And this late game timeout, getting a breather here. Important for the players to recharge. This is where you have a chance to get rehydrated with some Gatorade. Pirtles checked in for Toronto. D'Angelo Russell, he's checked in for Los Angeles. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. During that last break, I heard the Lakers coach as he addressed his team. Coach wanted his guys to ignore the scoreboard. He said, don't even look at the numbers. Just take it possession by possession. Make every chance count, and we'll see where we stand at the end of this game. Back to you guys. Great work, Allie. Thanks. Now, you have to extend that defense. I mean, you really have to stay connected to them at all times. Well, you know this. This is a guy who's looking for the shot the whole time. You have to know who you're guarding. KYP, know your personnel. They're going at it on offense. Neither team backing down. I'll tell you, we have seen great execution from both teams. Neither one giving an inch here. Reddish is checked in for the Lakers. But well, Christian Wood, a guy that we know is a three-level scorer, it's what earns him minutes on the floor. Mitchell's shot is good. Just over two and a half minutes played now. Final quarter of regulation. Russell against Mitchell. Russell to pass to Vanderbilt. Knocked away. It's stolen by Olenek. Here's Barnes. That one falls. Nice setup by Mitchell. And now a 12-point Raptor lead. Opportunistic play by Scotty Barnes. Recognizing his teammate makes a defensive play. Let me get out in transition. And count it. The shot is good, and he'll go to the line. That will help them. Now is the time to get aggressive. They need to keep feeding him the ball and let him go to work. And it's Mitchell with the ball for the Raptors. Up and over Russell. And it's Mitchell. The miss. The Lakers have gotten three of eight shot attempts to find the net here in the fourth quarter. Puts it up from 15. And again, it's the Lakers. Boy, when LeBron is pulling and hitting that jumper, you know he's in the zone. Just one of the most dangerous offensive players in the game. Now here's Barnes. Outside Mitchell. Three-pointer. Oh, again, Toronto with a triple. What a beautiful stroke from range. Defensively, you've got to try to take him out of his comfort zone. 
Russell against Mitchell. Russell, the pass to Vanderbilt. Down low. And Vanderbilt slams it in. This, to me, is an improving aspect of D'Angelo Russell's game. Reading the pick and roll. Nicely done. Barnes against Reddish. Pass to Pirtle. To the paint. Here's Dick. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. It's on LeBron James. And when you're looking at this year's rookie class, Dick stands out for his polish and versatility at the offensive end. And some changes here for the Raptors. Barrett's checked in for Olenek and quickly subbed in for Mitchell. Anthony Davis, he's checked in for the Lakers. Hachimura comes in for Reddish. Now here's Russell. Over quickly. Toronto grabs the miss. Hurdles. Listen, he knows he should have made that shot. We'll see if they can work it back to him in that same area. Pass to Barnes. Here's Barrett. Hachimura with the defensive effort. For Los Angeles, they've gone 5 of 11 so far in the fourth. James, outside. Here's Davis. No good off the glass. Toronto has gone 2 of 2 from outside so far in the fourth. Barnes passes to Barrett. Pirtle with the ball. Doubled by Achimura. Barnes finds Pirtle. Now Barrett. Shot clock at four. And blocked. That one goes careening off the glass. Ooh, poked away. Quickly against Russell. Here's Davis. That falls. Nice assist by Russell. Well, the more repetition he gets, the more floor awareness you develop. D'Angelo Russell showing a desire to get his teammates involved. And the Raptors making a change here. Brown's checked in. Reeves is checked in for the Lakers. Toronto has got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. Quickly outside. Pass to Barnes. Outside, Brown. Connects from downtown. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. One thing we've learned in the NBA, the game is never over. So you've got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. And Davis slams it home. And the length is hard to contend with. Davis using all of it for the putback points there. Pass to Pirtle. Back to Quickly. Driving in. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. And he just driving the stake in him there. He's a guy who just never lets up. Well, you love that he wants to wear out the defense. What a catalyst for his team. Incredible. Here's Davis, covered by Pirtle. Here's Barrett. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Boy, look at how confident R.J. Barrett is on the interior, right in his sweet spot. The first one falls. That one falls, so he hits both of them. For Los Angeles, they've gone 7 for 15 in the fourth. Davis with a screen on quickly. Russell with the ball. He's picked up by Pirtle. And that one's good. Davis. Yeah, between his length and touch, Davis is the perfect interior player. Barnes against James. Pass to Barrett. Back to Barnes. Takes the three. Barrett can't hit. The Lakers have gotten eight of 16 attempted shots to go here in the fourth. Davis with a screen on quickly. Now, here is James. He's guarded by Barnes. The fadeaway. That one's good from James on the assist by Russell. James has got nine points now in the quarter. Quickly against Russell. Quickly passes to Barrett. Outside, Brown. Tries to break his ice. Oh, and it's finished off by Barrett as he lays it in. 
And the Raptors lead by 11. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly and capitalizing. You know, the best thing about AD is he can contribute in every statistical category. And Barrett has got the ball here for the Toronto Raptors. And it's Barrett again missing. And for the Lakers, they're shooting 56% today. Russell against Brown. Shoots a fadeaway. And again, it's the Lakers. Uh, this is a dangerous area for LeBron James. You get him into that mid-range area, you don't know what he's going to do. Hachimura against Barrett. Over Hachimura. Barrett missing again. Listen, simply put, he's got to finish that. It's not like the defender was right on top of him. Pass to James. Outside for Russell. The three is up. Kept alive. And Davis slams it home. What an emphatic bucket by Davis. This is a guy who never backs down or gives up. Barrett against Hachimura. And the foul called on R.J. Barrett. That's his first foul of the game. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. And a second look at that rejection, taking no prisoners on defense there. Yeah, I love that they maintain the defensive energy even when they're behind. The Lakers time out, call time timeout. Out. They're trailing by five. 51 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Toronto on D. It's a five-point game. Davis with a screen on quickly. Pass to James. Right side Davis. He shoots again. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. And will go to the line. That free throw good from Davis. Well, this is why you run your offense through him in important situations. You know he's going to deliver. Here's Barrett. Ooh, he can't stop the run as that misses. Here are the Lakers with the ball. Trailing by two. Russell pass to Davis to tie it up. It's in! A huge shot to tie it up! Talk about stepping up in a big way. I'll tell you, it takes confidence to pull the trigger in that situation. You love guys who relish the moment. And Toronto calls time here. Now here's quickly. Green on Russell to the inside. Here's Barrett. Oh, it's off the mark. Here we go to overtime. Time expires. We're going to overtime. We've got more NBA basketball coming your way in just a minute. Attention, man. Now on the court for everyone. Get loud and let them hear it. Glad to have you with us as we get going in overtime. Neither team giving an inch in this game. Here's quickly. We've got R.J. Barrett. Yaka Pirtle out there with Barnes. Then it's Bruce Brown. And it's quickly in at the point guard position. And down it goes. Two points. Quickly's got 19 points. The Lakers trail. Russell finds James. Brown with the steal. Left side Barnes. 
Pass to Pirtle. Back to Quickly. With some arc. It's deflected. Well, that's the energy and effort that D'Angelo Russell brings on the defensive end. This guy has got the ability to be a factor there. Here's James. And it's Toronto with a rebound. Barnes has got four rebounds now. Inside. Sinks that one from the post. 23 points in the game. Scotty Barnes with a big-time delivery. Big spot, young man. Yes, sir. Pass to Davis. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free-throw line. That's on Jakob Pertl. First team foul. Shooting for Los Angeles. First one falls for him. Anthony Davis. At the line for two. Both free throws good from Davis. The Raptors have gone two of three from the field as OT gets going. Pass to Pirtle, to the paint. Here's Barnes, laid it in with a nice touch off the window. Barnes has got 25 points. There's real synergy in play right now on the offensive end. The pass was right where it needed to be. Davis with a screen on quickly. James with the ball. Just too much to handle inside. Well, should any of us be surprised if they need a bucket? LeBron says, get me the ball and delivers once again. Barrett passes to Barnes. It's stolen by James. Pass to Reeves. It's stolen by Pirtle. On the wing quickly. It's Barrett on the wing. Now here's Pirtle. Outside Barnes. Shot clock at six. Picked by Pirtle. Pulls it from the top of the key. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. And this is where you hope that he can find something easy so he can see the ball go through the net. Oh, man. He plays with a relentless motor in clutch time, too. Davis always wants the ball in his hands. Barnes with a screen on Russell. Russell against Quickly. And here's Brown for three. James with the rebound. And so it's James with it. He brings it up for the Lakers. To the middle. Count it! And of all the Browns championship characteristics, and there are many, his greatest may be his unselfishness. And Toronto calls time here. They're behind by two. There's 48 seconds left in OT. Quickly against Russell. Picked by Pirtle. Stolen by Davis. James outside. Back to Davis. Hachimura outside. Pass to Reeves. Now Davis. Six on the shot clock. And here's Russell. Pulls it from 20. Quickly with a rebound. And the Raptors call time here. They're down by two. 17 seconds left in overtime. They've done a great job of moving the ball tonight. Yeah, B.A., keeping everybody involved keeps everyone engaged. Barnes with a screen on Russell. And here's Brown for three. Oh, that shot had a chance, but the all-or-nothing shot attempt is off the mark. So it's a narrow victory for the Lakers, pulling it out for the W. Things looked a little uneven for them down the stretch, but in overtime, they took control. And B.A., I don't think they expected this one to be so hard fought, but when they went into overtime, they really poured the gas on the fire. And now let's check in with Allie LaForce with the player of the game. Allie. Well, A.D., it was close, but you got it done. What did you see out there tonight? 
our defense took a night off. You know, we wasn't as great defensively as we usually are. And we were able to stay in the game, but we were able to get some stops down the end of the game and able to come out with the win. But uh, we have to do a better job defensively. Um, ultimately, we get the win, and you know, we can't be upset with ourselves, but you know, we can't get better. Never satisfied with just a win. Thanks, AD. Allie, thank you as always. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Doris Burke, and the rest of our 2K team, this is Brian Anderson signing off. Now it's time for the New Balance Player of the Game, Anthony Davis.